My biggest memory from that one, I think, was on the was on the Friday night when we did the presentation to everybody and we talked we talked them through the route and we were explaining how, how it was over a hundred mile. We had about nine thousand foot of climbing in a route that probably wouldn't have been out of place in the Tour de France. Indeed. And the atmosphere was good on Saturday night as well with Joanna Ralph Lushan. I think particularly af afterwards, everybody was was just buzzing. I think the last few hours. A really unique event, and it's been really good fun. New Forest was absolutely superb. I was just gutted in a way that we had such a lovely hotel by the sea, and having been there in August when it was 30 <laughs> Celsius and done a bit of cycling, I kind of think in a way we 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 delivered perfection with that event and. And the only thing that got in the way was the absolutely awful weather, but... They, they did not I mean. stop raining. I think Mark was a bit of a strange one. I don't think it was what people were expecting. Um, and when it was announced, I think there was a bit of a rumble around the room of... A, a lot of people knew who he was, but there was also a lot of people who didn't really un understand what he'd achieved and what he'd done. But the way he delivered his speech and what he'd gone through his career and how he built up to this ultra endurance athlete and then what he was able to achieve um, and how he achieved the round the world trip that was really amazing like like mark said the, the standing ovation that he got at the end was uh, was was really good and inspiring what an amazing day it's been what a great event to be a part of the the sicker cycle 2018. david miller then in the uh, in the after dinner speech when he was he just kind of really ca captured the day beautifully when we announced David Miller on the Friday night, that, that got quite a good reception. I wasn't quite expecting that they'd be like, everyone went, ooh, okay, big, and a big round of applause afterwards. It did, didn't it? The toughest endurance uh, effort would have probably been Bournemouth for me. So looking out the window in the morning, seeing the rain coming down and knowing that it was set for the day and you were going to be sat in that rain and you were going to be sat in there for a good three hours. But, but the number of guys that come in from overseas as well to be part of the event, I think, just just goes to show it's it's worth it's worth travelling for, and uh, I think uh, I think people do it for for the pleasure and enjoyment that comes with the weekend. It's sometimes nice just to go and look at the bike room with with like you know 150 bikes crammed in on the on the racking and things like that, and you just think, wow, this is this is becoming quite a big uh, quite a big event these days and I, I can remember it at the after the event on the sunday at bournemouth um being stopped in the car park by by um, a couple of guys who'd, who'd ridden and sort of been on quite a few of the events and they were they were kind of complimenting us on the on the show that goes on around around the event i think I mean, all the all the bits and pieces that we put on in the evening and such i think that's part of what makes people want to come back year on year and you kind of get to that point because like I've been to quite a few now and there's certain people from different they're invited from different target markets so professionally you wouldn't really engage with them but you look forward to seeing these people every year because they come every year and it's like that type that new little seeker cycle family of people that you you see all the time it is it is it's a great event that we that we look forward to and you know Andrea does a sterling job um, organising everything from the, our global um, colleagues that are flying in for it to everybody in the UK. So um, what can you tell me about Woptopia 2020? Totally different. Um, yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a virtual landscape that we'll be riding through. It's going to be quite a different challenge. And the fact that it's open to a global audience, we could have pro racers turning up on the day. We could have uh, very, very good enthusiasts turning up on the day and riding, and then also anybody associated with Seeker will be riding it as well. So, yeah, it'll be good. It'll be interesting to see what uh, what mix of riders we get on the day, anyway. Yeah, and for, I suppose for, it's worth saying for those that, that obviously can't, uh, that, that don't have access to uh, to Zwift as well, can just uh, post rides on our Strava page, and uh, we've got we've got a few uh, plenty of giveaways as well, just to uh, to acknowledge all any achievements um, on the day. I think that was a good a good day when we went and visited the air ambulances yeah. headquarters in Manchester as well. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Sort of ventilator that we we uh, we funded, and uh, I can always remember Fee when when the do the doctor who'd been out in an ambulance I think a couple of days earlier had attended yeah. a, a young child who'd been se se severely injured, and um, he said if we'd have had the old ventilator with us, we'd have, we wouldn't have been able to treat to, to treat him. And uh, I think it, we were all stood there going. Wow, yeah. you, know, you kind of just realise how, how big an impact that uh, that potentially what we did with, with that particular uh, um, legacy game.
World Bike Relief they're, um, is effectively a, an international charity that um, that raises funds to provide bicycles for uh, areas of the world affected by extreme poverty and uh, that can that can often be a lifeline for people in allowing them to collect water, get water, um, access education or take goods to market. Where do you find those moments in life these days? We're also lost in our devices, we're also lost in our work and family and everything's so omnipresent and we get so little chance to actually go out there and just do.